it's funny how as much as things change, it all stays the same. So I'm at the park. I found a park and uh, well, I have a brand new toy. Now the box doesn't allow it to look like a brand new toy because Florida humidity is wonderful and it, it just keeps everything intact as you can see. But in this box is something that resonates to two things. So one of those things is like Christmas. And the other thing, well, let's see if we can put it together here. I have a uh, uh, park police right behind me. We're, we're doing a park, uh, we're doing a park unboxing. It's a shame that this country has come to the point where we have to be skeptical of a tall male going to a park with a large, very large box and a camera and how, how that should be uh, looked at as skeptical. Not, not good. However, this thing is looking very good and very nice. Adjectives I'd also like to think that I possess. Well, let's cut her open. So uh, that, that's the uh, sheriff car over there. It, it, it's great. What's also great is this bike comes 90% assembled. You know what, as long as he's enjoying the show as much as I'm enjoying the size of this battery, you know, we're all winning. Okay, by now I think you've picked up on the second thing and that is going to school. And so many of you were going to school when you first found me and getting off the, the bus and, and looking forward to that 3D Machines production with 3D Machines and Jake the Toilet Snake and Seth and all of our crazy shenanigans. I used to ride a bike to school. Therefore, bikes bring back a nostalgic, a nostalgic feeling to my, my heart. Boxes in boxes, always a great time. It's like the, the presence inside the stocking, you know? You open up one thing and then it just leads to another and another. We got pedals, looks like a light reflector, stuff. This is a small little inverter I carry around with me for like my laptop and GoPros and stuff. And this is the first bike battery that allows me to just plug the charger in and have it charge with this inverter. That I dig. So it's like a big laptop battery, really. We're making great progress here. My childhood is coming back to me. I, I'm, I'm in love. I mean, look at the look at the craftsmanship on this thing. Look at the welds. Look at the paint job on this thing. I mean, the decals. This thing is the cat's meow. Oh, I didn't assemble something right. That little shack back there had air. I needed air. Yo, check it out. The bike is together, the battery is installed. Now let's go ahead, take this thing out for a rip and answer some of your guys' questions and concerns and go over some of the polls we had a little bit ago. I like this one. I like this bridge too. And then you have wildlife going on here. Check the toilet snakes, a big fan of those birds. Stay out here long enough, you'll probably even see an alligator. At this point in the video, I'd like to recognize the folks that go ahead and use their meat sticks and comment on a 3D Machines production from time to time. So we have Perk Love SU. This guy is my childhood. Way better than Braden B. I guess this is also a jab at Braden Price. He pioneered this stuff heart heart. Both the actual heart and then the handmade heart. The reason why I brought the whole school thing up is because I lived less than a mile away from school, so I had to ride my bike. So, so riding bikes and opening up big pack packages, opening up big packages is like having Christmas, but then riding the bicycle is like going to school again. And yeah, you know, the, the getting to school sucked because you had to wake up early, but then afterwards it's like, hey, I don't have to walk because I rode this morning, so now I can get home quickly to do nothing. Carson Ganlot, what I would give to go back to these days. Amen. Jack Vlogs, go back to New York, get yourself a project car or truck, and have a laugh. That's what made me watch your old videos. I miss the time lapses the most. Jack, I, I included the time lapse in this video for you. You're welcome. Let's check this bike out. Been 
on the Evader for a little bit now. It's uh, the Evader C3 City, and they have another uh, alteration of this, a variation of this bike. Um, it, that variation has rear suspension. This one has the rack. So all you people that like your substance and like to carry it on the back here, the rack will work just fine. And for all you that uh, have all these brilliant ideas, such as myself, maybe you want to throw somebody like uh, Dick the Toys thing on the back. Whatever. Uh, I'm trying to make my way up to that thing. I've never been up there before. My dad must have been here. <laughs> my dad must have been here. I think I found the entrance to this place. Um, we're, we're gonna hit it. I feel like Homer Simpson. I'm like really excited about uh, this simple, simple. Well, it's, I don't know if it's that simple. I mean, I've never crossed anything like this in a, any other state, so. Florida, your bike trails are quite sophisticated and I appreciate them. How are we doing? Really windy up here. So I just wanna give you a... Aww. The Hondas, man. Gotta love the Honda. do the no-handed thing in front of the girls because you were such a cool guy for doing that up to like fourth grade and then after that it was like you know it's, it's not as cool um, we're doing that this bike has 16 gears it has five modes of assist disc brakes and a lot more so that green trail actually sent me to a place of familiar film me film, film, familiar familiar air Something I'm familiar with. Oh, gravel pit. Well, you guys used to see us ride dirt bikes and four wheelers all the time at the gravel pit. Oh, oh, almost. I was getting into trouble hitting hill climbs, falling off the dirt bikes, rolling the dirt bikes down the hills. Great times. Today's great. I feel like a big kid. So I can already see the comments in the comment section. So I figured I'd go over exactly what's going on here. So this is the Evader C3 City model. The battery actually fits right in the frame, nice and sleek here. And that's a 360 watt hour battery. It takes about four hours to charge. You can charge it either on or off of the bike. It has a mid drive motor. This one happens to be a 250 watt. In pedal assist mode, this bike will go about 60 miles on a charge. It has 27 and a half CST tires, eight gears on the back, two on the front, making it 16 gears. The bike weighs 59 pounds. Power assist on the left, along with the two gears on the front, five modes of assist. And so far the top speed is 25 miles an hour for myself. And the max load is 220 pounds. So maybe I can't put Jake the Toilet Snake on the back. It's incredibly windy today. Now, I don't know if it's the wind or if people are hating on these things, but these things are down everywhere. I grew up in the country. Evader's given me the opportunity to live like I were in the city. Great commuter bike. Uh-oh, I found the competition. me or does this thing not look like a big green eggs and ham even though I, I think that the eggs were green not the ham if the ham were green that'd be it comments this one's very fitting it comes from a, a user anonymous 2 a little a ADD but liked it I don't remember doing any addition in that that uh, video or subtraction uh, maybe maybe some division but a lot of you guys are, are inquiring about me staying in New York and as you can see I'm, I'm not New York anymore I went up there for a few weeks down here in Florida now I, I like Florida you know there's no snow there's there's beautiful weather uh, there's uh, snake skins in restaurant bathrooms we have phenomenal water i don't know it just feels right i hope you guys enjoyed this 3 machines production until next time me and the evader out i have a, a coupon code in the description they're also running a 300 off uh, coupon if you don't want to use my coupon I, i'll save you more money though um yeah we'll see you guys later